Hi, this is Mark DiCiani, University Dean at the University of the Arts in Philadelphia, and welcome to our podcast series featuring alumni. Hi, my name is Nick Costa, and I'm an alum of the School of Music, Music Performance, Class of 2010, and the MAT program, Class of 2011. After graduation, I taught private lessons at a local music store and was an independent musician primarily playing in two original bands. In 2013, I was hired as the percussion coordinator at Villanova University, as well as an instrumental music teacher for the School District of Philadelphia, specializing in percussion. I also joined the UArt School of Music faculty in January of 2015. My time at UArt as a student has helped me create and sustain a successful career. As a performance major, the small class sizes and weekly one-on-one -on -one lessons helped me hone my craft as a drummer, to the point that I was selected for the drum chair for the 2014-2015 Mamma Mia! National Broadway Tour. As exciting as that sounds, being an educator was always my end game, and my time in the MAT program prepared me for that part of my career. As an educator, I've been assisting the School District of Philadelphia with their modern band initiative. This is where we create small wedding or corporate bands for our students to be a part of. Being that my background is in drum set studies, I am able to work with the students learning drum set rather than the traditional classical percussion elements they're used to learning. I've also been able to write curriculum on how to integrate drum set studies into the general music classroom, as well as facilitate workshops and clinics for other music educators. Recently, the Pennsylvania Department of Education reached out to our district for assistance with implementing modern band curriculum for the entire state. Because of my involvement with this initiative with the School District of Philadelphia, I am now acting as a consultant for the PA Department of Education in order to implement this across the entire state. Combining that with teaching roughly 175 students on a weekly basis and writing drum lessons for publications like Modern Drummer Magazine have allowed me to become an educational artist with Ludwig Drums, Zildjian Cymbals, Vic Firth Sticks, Remo Drumheads, and Roland Electronics. Although the majority of my career is in education, I'm still actively performing as an independent drummer for various recording sessions, groups, and even churches in the area including an alternative group, St. Brendan. In fact, our song, Easy, is the one that you hear in the background. The advice that I can give to younger drummers is immerse yourself in all aspects of drumming. Study all the various styles, focus on playing to the song rather than playing chops, get comfortable reading charts and notation, use your ears to your advantage, and learn about the science on how a drum set actually works. You have to be more than just a player, and by working on those various topics, you will develop the skills needed for a successful career. Finally, make sure that you network. One of the biggest lessons I learned from UArts was to network with everyone, regardless of style, instrument, background, or even experience. By doing so, while leaving a positive impression on everyone you meet, will help you in the long run, because you never know who might call you for a gig. If you would like to get in contact with me, feel free to do so through my website, nickcostamusic.com. You can also find me on Twitter and Instagram at Practically Nick, on YouTube at Nick Costa Music, and on Facebook at Nick Costa Drums. You've been listening to Connect, a podcast series featuring alumni of the University of the Arts in Philadelphia. Feel free to contact me, Mark DiCiani, at M-D-I-C-C-I-A-N-I -C -C -I -I at U-A-R-T-S dot E-D-U, or Tim Pop, Senior Director for Alumni Relations at T-P-O-P-P -P -P at U-A-R-T-S dot E-D-U. Thanks for listening. <laughs>